This really is a roast of Spanish mackerel and I'm gonna slide it in. Make sure you go this way up. That way, when it comes to getting it out, it's gonna be a little bit easier because we're gonna cook this quite thoroughly, but it's really, really gonna get infused with all these beautiful flavors. But like I said, make sure this bone is facing upwards. Slide on your lid, keep the temperature at a nice, gentle simmer for about 15 to 20 minutes. Now, because of that stainless steel base, there's no hot spots in the bottom there, so it's gonna enable us to pot roast this beautiful piece of Spanish mackerel. <sighs> 25 minutes, my mackerel has just been pot roasting away there in the tomato and Magic is probably the only word that describes it. I'm gonna serve this very, very simply with a little bit more of my basil, which I'm just gonna tear straight into some rocket leaves. Nice and chunky. Give it a squeege of some lemon juice. These flavors just really, really complement this tomato and caper and olives and pine nuts magnificently. A splash of extra verge and just give that a toss. That is the simplest little salad, but it really loves this mackerel. Now, the other good thing about this mackerel is by cooking it in those big chunks, come and have a look at this, you'll see it's fallen away from the bone. It's very easy to serve a piece. You just pull it away. Perfect. Nice Spanish mackerel steak. Good hit of sauce, with a bit of everything. And finish it off with a touch of your wild rocket salad. Oh yeah. Tomato roasted Spanish mackerel. What a little beauty. Better just have a go on that sauce. You've seen me do it, and now it's your turn. You can make lots of tasty dishes at home with the Alive and Cooking Series 3 cookbook with over 120 of my favourite easy-to-prepare recipes. Order your copy now at aliveandcooking.com.au.